Hello friends, welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis. In last one year, we have not only seen ramp up in the development of indigenously developed military weapons and hardware, but also increasing focus towards the export of these equipments to other countries. Now today, we are going to share some good news regarding the same, but before that, we would bust the rumor and propaganda being spread about Indian defense equipment by Pakistan. Recently, there were rumors being spread on social media platforms by our infamous neighbors regarding Swati Radar. According to these rumors, the heavy loss of Armenian forces by the drones of Azerbaijan was due to the failure of India's Swati weapon locating radar, which was procured by Armenia. However, the fact is that Swati WLR or weapon locating radar was not yet delivered to Armenia by India and its delivery has started now. Talking about Swati WLR deal, back in March 2020, Swati radar has outperformed Russian and Poland radar in the trials conducted to win a defense deal worth $40 million from Armenia. Now, India is yet to supply four set of Swati radar as part of this deal. Now today, an Armenian telegraph channel has shared a video showing Swati WLR stations being loaded into an AN-124 military transport aircraft of the Russian Aerospace Forces for subsequent delivery to Armenia. Swati WLR is developed by India's premier R&D organization DRDO. It is an electronically scanned phased radar which provides fast, automatic and accurate tracking of enemy weapons like mortar, shells, rockets in its 40 km range and the upgraded version can track up to 50 km. Swati WLR radar has a headlight operating C-band for faster and accurate locating of the enemy fire weapons. It can operate simultaneously with several up to seven shells fired from different types of weapon from different directions. The system is capable of adjusting the fire of own artillery also. The Swati radar can detect weapons that include 81 mm or higher caliber mortars, 105 mm or higher caliber shells and 120 mm or higher caliber flying rockets. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.